Hi, I'm Dr. Amy Sarin, neuropsychologist and chief science officer of the Touchpoint Solution. Did you know that according to the Center for Disease Control, one in 59 children have been identified with an autism spectrum disorder? ASD is one of the most common developmental disabilities affecting our society today and is four times more common among boys than girls. Today we're going to learn about how the salience network, the network in the brain responsible for processing stress, is used by doctors to detect autism. We'll explore how stress can inhibit daily functioning for individuals with autism to gain a better understanding of this topic. In the Science of Stress Part 2, I talked a lot about the salience network. And this is actually one of the key networks that researchers now can look at and with a pretty good level of certainty diagnose things like autism based on how that network is functioning. Now I think the reason why is because not only does the salience network kind of make the decision for you of what you're going to pay attention to. Are you going to be internally focused or externally focused, okay? Or are you going to go into nervous system reactivity and fight or flight, or are you going to stay calm? Well, if you think about those things, these are key problems in individuals with autism. They're really internally focused, and just the slightest sensory change in the environment can send them into nervous system reactivity. The salience network also integrates really heavily with other brain networks that control social behavior, self-awareness, and communication. Problems with these are rampant in individuals with autism and other developmental disabilities. And this is why we think that although I develop touch points to eradicate post-traumatic stress disorder and help people with general stress, this is why we think that they're helping individuals with developmental disabilities and autism is because the same brain networks that are choosing the stress reactivity, okay, those are modulated by the BLAST technology and the touch points. 